Hello, this is reporter Zach Collins with a special interview with John Ernst Smith Zilliger. This is FCA TV exclusive and the first interview using our Time Warp feature. So, Mr. Matt Zilliger, how does your story begin? I was born in Suriname, South America on September 15th, 1852. My father was a Dutch engineer. My earliest memories are when I was at when I was 10 years old working in a machine factory with my father. Wow, 10 years old? I bet that was a lot of fun. How did you end up in America? The machine shop was just beginning. After I turned 19, I decided that I wanted to see the world. So I became a sailor. I settled in Philadelphia. Did you settle in Philadelphia or did you move on from there? No, I could not settle in Philadelphia since I was a dark skinned man. I could not make a living there because times were bad. I moved to Lynn, Massachusetts, the shoe industry, because it was growing and I wanted in on it. What did you do in Lynn? I found a position as an apprentice or trainee in a shoe factory. I became a cordwainer. Excuse me, a what? A cordwainer is a person who crafts shoes almost by, all by hand. We make a lace, which is a mold of a person's foot, usually from wood or stone in case you didn't know that either. This is where I got the idea for my machine. Go on. Tell me about this machine. What does it do? Well, the process of attaching the shoe body to the sole was all done by hand and it took a long time. I wanted a solution to this problem with our production. So my machine, my machine held the shoe by the, on the lace, then pulled the lever around the heel and drove nails into it. Thank you so much, Mr. Metzeluger, for your time. It's easy to see why my generation honors you during Black History Month. Now it's time to go back to our studio. I'm sorry to report that Mr. Matt Zilliger died shortly after our interview on August 24th, 1889 at the age of 37 of tuberculosis, which he caught in 1886. He received his patent on March 20th, 1883. His short life had a big impact on our nation. He also invented the Nell Machine on February 25th, 1896, patent number 421,726, and the tax separating machine on March 25th, 1890. Patent number 423,937 after his death and the mechanism for disputing tax on November 26, 1889, number 415,726 after his death as well.